Hey, it's Shannon. And Treehouse setting up Paul. And we're here with the Blind Bag Treehouse of Awesomeness, which is one of our long running episodes. I think this is like episode number 44 or 45 or something wow. crazy. So if you like the Blind Bag Treehouses, you can check out our playlist for Blind Bag Treehouse and see every single one of them. Yes, go do that after <laughs> this video. Yes, after this video. But let's go ahead and check out some of these good toys. I think I want to start with this My Little Pony right here. This is a Funko Mystery Mini. And these are the different ones you can find inside. And none of them are rare. They all have the same chances of finding one inside. So let's see which one we get inside today. Who is it going to be? I love Captain America Potato Head back there. <laughs> he was hiding. And there's a creeper too. Captain America's enough to use a shield to guard against the detonation. Yeah. Cool. So this is Nightmare Moon? Is that who I it is? I think so. Yeah, I think that's right. Yes, that's right. She's really awesome. I love her hair. She has glitter in her hair. She has a cutie mark on both sides. Because she's awesome. She is awesome. This is a really cool figure. And she has a little moon right there. Awesome. All right, now let's open a Num Num. So this is series one, and this is a little blind bag pudding cup, or ice cream cup. Oh, check out this one, it's cute. Ooh, very cool. I think I this is a brand new one. Yeah, I don't remember that one. Let me look at the checklist here. Okay, so let's just see. Num Nums come with the top piece, which is really soft and squishy, and this is called a Num. And then the bottom pieces, which are the Noms, come in two different ways. In the little pudding cup things, they are lip glosses. And in the um, like packages that you can buy, the big packages, those are motorized. I think that that is raspberry cream. I think that's who the nom is. All right. These things are scented. Smell good, huh? Oh, that's the mint one. Yummy. And then here's our little num and you can do lots of fun things with these. They can even be hats for some of your favorite dolls. Yes, they can be. Which we have done. So there we go. I'm gonna just keep clearing stuff right up front here so we have room for all our toys. So next, we are gonna open this SpongeBob SquarePants Cubit. Now we have opened these before, they're really cool. This is series one and it comes with a figure inside and a little display case. Yeah, they're kind of neat. Oh, check it out. We have... Who do we have? SpongeBob is the bat. I'm trying to figure out where's the little opening. Yeah, they, those are going to be tough to open. Uh, I can open it for you if you need. There's the opening. <laughs> okay. So here is SpongeBob. These little um, cases are cool because you can stack them on one another and you can store figures inside. Let's take a look at SpongeBob. <laughs> ah. He's awesome. He's a bat. <laughs> it's bat. Cupcake. <laughs> Yay, cupcake. Yay, cupcake. <laughs> so there is SpongeBob being Batman or something. <laughs> okay, and now let's go over to this one. So this is a Looney Tune figure by Kid Robot. And there are a bunch of different ones in this series. Some of them are even rare. And we have a video where we opened a ton of these. So if you like these, go back into our videos and check that out. These figures are really cool. So let's see, do we have a little tear strip? Yes, we do. We need Porky Pig. We haven't seen Porky Pig. Nor have we so it is. seen... I think we've gotten everybody else. Porky Pig. <laughs> we have Daffy Duck. Daffy Duck. Look at how big his duck bill is. Yes. <laughs> You're despicable. <laughs> so there he is. He's all like battle damaged. Yep. Battle damaged duck. That's because he has a can of gasoline here. So <laughs> I think he was up to no good and blew himself up instead of whatever he was trying to do. So super awesome figure. I love Daffy Duck. All right, we're gonna just keep on going that way and we're gonna open this. So this is really awesome. This is a Disney Princess Little Kingdom by Hasbro. This is the fashion change Ariel. And we have been opening a ton of the Little Kingdom stuff because we absolutely love it. 
So let's go ahead and take her out of the package and take a better look at her. Okay, so here's Ariel, and these remind me a lot of Polly Pocket, and that's what I think I love so much about them. So the way these work is they have these little plastic pieces that come with them. Here's one of the little ones in the package, which is a little seahorse that's awesome. And here's another one. This looks like a flower. There are different holes on the clothing and on the dolls, and you can just snap these in, and then they're little accessories. So let's see, let's put the little seahorse over here on her dress. Now what makes this one different than the other ones is this one actually also comes with a change of clothes. Most of the Little Kingdom ones so far have just had the outfit that the princess was in. Yeah, I really like that one. Yeah, so the concept behind these is you can mix and match the clothes between all your different princesses. And I'm going to show you how easy it is to do that. So here she is in her fancy ball gown, but we're just going to switch her to a different outfit. So the shirts come off, and the top layer of the skirt comes off, and then this bottom layer comes off. And you can see how easy it is to take all those pieces off. And then we can take the new pieces, and we can get her dressed. And all of the princesses can share clothes. So let's see, let's put her little shirt on. And then this piece. Now they're really easy to dress. My only thing, just to let you know, if you have a little girl that wants to take them out somewhere with her, you know, to the store or something when you shop, just be careful that the little tops I find very easy to come off. So I wouldn't want your little girl to lose that piece. Yeah, that is such a pretty dress. But yeah, look how cute she looks. I love the colors of it and you can see how easy it is to just switch the outfits. And then you could even take the, um, snap-ins off the other outfit and add it to this one. So now she has a little seahorse. Yeah. So these are really cool. And that's a Disney Little Kingdom. Let's see. We're going to stand her right there. And then we're going to move on to our first Play-Doh surprise. So look at this awesome Play-Doh cupcake Paul made for us. We have a cherry. <laughs> Delicious. We have some yummy orange frosting, and then our brown cupcake. I wonder what's in here. Oh, look. <laughs> There's a surprise inside the cupcake. It's Alex from Minecraft. That's from the Obsidian, Obsidian series. I think that's Alex in the Enchanted Armor. She's purple, so she's awesome. That's right. It's an enchanted cupcake. Cool. All right, let's just keep going this way. Let's open a Paw Patrol Mashems. These are super squishy, and it's Series 1. I would really like a Marshall, which is the Dalmatian. Ouch. We saw a Dalmatian in a car the other day. We it did. was in the back of a smart car. Which was really funny. Yeah, and he took up, like, the entire car, and he was so cute. Whoops, I'm knocking everything over. <laughs> okay, let's see if we have a Dalmatian. Nope. We have oh, we got Chase. Chase, the police puppy. Cool. At least we got something different. We've been getting yeah. a lot of rubble and um, Rocky. Rocky. So and there is Chase. Some Zuma. And he kind of looks good with Captain America. He does. He would be <laughs> Captain America's friend. Yes, he would. Okay, so there he is. Let's get Lemon Meringue. She fell over. Oh no! Now Ariel fell over. <laughs> okay, what should we open next, Paul? How about we open? The other Play-Doh cupcake. Okay, the other Play-Doh cupcake. Let's see if we can get Ariel to stand up. Their little feet are small, so sometimes it's hard yeah. to make them stand. Play-Doh cupcake, number two. We have another cherry. <laughs> and more delicious frosting. Look at it, it's multicolored frosting. Right. Let's see what's in this cupcake. Are you ready? Oh, <laughs> that's so silly. Mini muffin. Come out, mini muffin. She was really <laughs> stuck in there. Mini Muffin from Season 1 Shopkins was stuck inside the Play-Doh. So, she matches Alex. They're both purple. Yes. Oh, no. They both came out of cupcakes. But probably nothing will come out of a cupcake you have. Probably not. <laughs> All right. Now, on to the Vinyl Mission Toy Story by Disney. These are keychains, and they're really cool. We've opened quite a few of these before, and they're awesome. 
I hope we get Piggy. Or Piggy. Or him. Yeah. Let's see. I think I want Buzz. We haven't seen Buzz yet. <gasps> hey, we got him. I got him. Come on out. Come on out, him. These little <laughs> plastic bags that are in are rough. Now let's just do this. <laughs> Those are some heavy duty plastic bags, I'm telling you. Let's see? Do, 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 do. All right, there's Ham. Look how awesome he is. Very cool. <laughs> and I love the little clear Mickey Mouse ears on these. All vinyl missions have the little Mickey ears, which I love. All right, so there's Ham. Now we're going to move on to the Simpsons figure. It's the Woohoo 25 Years Collection mm -hmm. by Kid Robot. Yes? Kid, yes. Yeah, Kid yeah, Robot. Robot. So here are the figures you can get, and some of these are rare. And we have gotten almost every rare figure. Yeah, we opened a whole case of these, so if you like these, check out right there. I will link that video, and you can check it out. Let's see who we have today. Well, that tear strip didn't work at ah. all. <laughs> Fold you. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, we have Bart. Bart is Bart Man. His little superhero pose. This Bart is how Paul runs pose. around the house with a little superhero cape. Sometimes. <laughs> so there is Bart. He's very cool. He is very cool. He's going to go hang out by Twyla and Frankie. Now, I don't recommend you do this, but I'm just going to have some fun here. Uh-oh. Bart. Bart's hair. Play-Doh. You're going to get Play-Doh stuck in Bart's head. I hope not. Now he has a hat. No. Ooh! Hey, that's Look that. awesome. Look at how textured that is. Pretty cool. And your Bart's still clean. <laughs> okay, so we have another layer of surprises up here, but before we get to those... We're going to go ahead and open this Shopkins Season 4 12 Ooh, pack. Very nice. So check them out. Let's open them up. First up, we have the Cheeky Cherries. The Cheeky Cherries. We have Tiny Tree. Tiny Tree. Awesome. Cinnabon. Yeah, Cinnabon. This is one of the Petkins. This is Shy Pie Cherry Pie. Yes. This is Jiggly Jelly. <laughs> jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. It's one of my jiggle, favorite. Jiggle, jiggle. That's one of my favorite season fours. Okay. Handbag Harriet. I love this one in this color. I just love it. In that love color? it, love it, love it. Yep. Here's another petkin. This is the Dinky Drink. It reminds me of a Monster High drink. Yeah. This is Mary Wishes, the adorable cupcake who's awesome. She is awesome. Edgar Egg, Egg Cup. Cup. And I love it in pink. And then, ah, oh, it went away. Where'd uh -oh. it go? I'll get it. I'll get it. I got it. You got it? Okay. It's Dolly Donut. Dolly Donut, who rolled away. Yes. I usually call her Rolly Donut or something. <laughs> Dolly Donut. Dolly Donut. She looks delicious. She does. She makes me want to eat a donut. When I see her, it makes me want a donut. I don't need to see her to want to eat a donut. I just <laughs> want to eat a donut because they're delicious. <laughs> All right, donuts are Paul's weakness. Yes. Here are our two hidden Shopkins inside our case. Let's see what we got. Oh, check it out. Ooh. Ooh. So our first one is another Petkin. This is Big Topping. And we got an ultra rare, which that's ultra exciting. We have a pink tennis ball. Very cool. It's a little tennis ball from the pet shop category. So in season four, it's pretty cool because the pet shop category, the entire category is ultra rare. And they're really sparkly and they awesome. They are really sparkly. Moose, do this again, please. Yeah. They're awesome. <laughs> All right, we have four surprises left. So I think the first thing we're going to open <laughs> hmm. is the Moshi Monster Magnificent, Magnificent Circus. There are 16 to collect in here plus gold ones. Ooh. So these are the ones that come inside. I still want a bloopy. A bloopy? Bloopy. Let's try to get you a bloopy. 
Let's see. Oops, I'm cutting the card inside. The card is all the way at the very top. So the card we have is Poquito. 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 And our first figure, oh, it was so close to Bloopy. So close. This is uh, Dr. C. Fings. Yeah. Is that who Do that is? Yeah, Dr. C. Fings. Dr. Dr. C. Fings. Mm. I'm a little bit dubious of you, Dr. C. Fings. <laughs> dressed like a clown. I'm with you. Okay, here's our other one. <gasps> it's a Bloopy, right? Is it Bloopy? Yeah. Yep, it's Bloopy. You got your Bloopy. Got the Bloopy. Look at his tie. His tie sticks straight out. I didn't know what that was, but yeah, that's awesome. Whoa, there he goes. I like his tie. I love his hair. It's Bloopy. Now, when one of our sons was younger, there was a TV show called Bloopy. Bloopy's Playhouse or something, and Bloopy was an egg. Yeah, Bloopy was a big purple <laughs> egg. No, it was white. Was he? Yeah, I think so. He was purple. Okay. <laughs> he loved Bloopy. <laughs> but that blue piece, I like even this better. figure, but, but I don't really like clowns, so it's unusual <laughs> that I like that figure so much. <laughs> okay, you can't see most of our stuff up here anymore, but it's still there. But it's still there. But we're gonna open a Unicorno Series Four by Tokidoki, and these are the different ones that come in the collection. And today, I hope we get Can Can because Can Can would go with the clown thing. We just got two clowns. Two Out of Motion Monsters. Oh, Both were clowns. All right. Oh, I love this one. This is one of my favorites that from this. This is Yuki. Yuki. This is the frozen unicorno. Yeah. Not really, but it reminds me of Elsa. It has little snowflakes, and I love the snowflake up here on its head. And I just love the colors and everything. It just makes me really happy and makes me think of winter. I love snow, so I love that one. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, let's open this. Oh, ah! Crash. crash. <laughs> let's open this Play-Doh surprise. I think this can has a surprise in it today. Let's see. Let's see. Hang on, I gotta fix our toys. It's driving me bonkers. Uh. Come on, Num Num. Who wants ooh, to wear? Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Bart Simpson with a Num Num hat. Uh, awesome. <laughs> oh no, fell over. Okay, you can go ahead and open. I'll okay. Stand up. What's inside? This is my favorite Play Doh ever made. <laughs> is this um, sparkly Play Doh? I think they should make more. Let's see. Oh, it's such nice soft Play Doh. <laughs> <gasps> Do you guys see who it is? It's Bubbles from season one. And Bubbles is adorable. I'm going to get the Play-Doh out of Bubbles. <laughs> oh, there's still Play-Doh stuck in Bubbles. There we go. All better. She's so cool and so awesome and so pink. She is. Just she's like really the Play-Doh she was in. Yep. Oh, no, she's got a little piece of glitter on her. <laughs> and guess where she's going to sit? Where? In Edgar Egg Cup. Perfect. Yep, perfect fit. Okay, last but not least is a Disney Tsum Tsum Mystery Stack Pack, Series 1. These are by Jack's Pacific, and they are completely awesome. I'm loving them. We have gotten all of them except for two. We still need Stitch and Dale. No, we need Dale and Lucky. Oh, yeah, sorry. Dale and Lucky. We did get Stitch. We did get Stitch. So hopefully we'll get one of those. If you guys like these, also you can check our videos. We opened a whole bunch of them in one video. If you like this video, leave it a big thumbs up. <laughs> that's what I'm doing right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got a duplicate, but that's okay. It's still really, really cool. So this is Marie. And this was the very first one of these that I opened. And it was kind of funny trying to learn how to put them together. Because Marie comes in a lot of pieces. And the pieces only go together one specific way. Yeah, it's like a puzzle. Yeah, so see, like, that one won't fit, and that one won't fit. Let's put it that way. Nope. See? Isn't it fun? No, that's... <laughs> I had it right the first time. The little points are at the top of the bed. Why can't I get it? Aha! There you go. Didn't seem like it wanted to fit the first time. Now, these are a little bit hard 
sometimes to put together, but as soon as you get them together, they stay together really well. Yes. Okay, so I had the the top of the bed instead of the bottom of the bed. See, I told you, you know, it's it's not that these are hard to put together. It's I'm challenged. <laughs> <laughs> but nah. they only go together one very specific way. So if you do it wrong, you're done. <laughs> but if you do it correctly, they oh, fit together really well. <laughs> they fit together amazingly well. They hold together. You can see it was a bunch of separate pieces, but it doesn't come apart. And there's Marie, and she can go inside her little bed. She can hang out like that. Or she can go all the way inside. Really cute. So these are awesome. I'm really loving those little Tsum Tsums. All right. Well, if you guys liked this video or liked watching me struggle putting Marie's bed together, leave the video a thumbs up, like Spidey Big said. Don't forget to subscribe to PS Toy Reviews. Look how tough the bed is. It can hold a spider spud. <laughs> ah! And we'll see you next time. See you later. The Arendelle Treat Shop. And when I saw this one, I'm like, Paul would love this one. I do. I love the little house. I love the little treat shop. Yeah, look, Olaf's on the door. Yeah, I just like the treat shop. <laughs> so this is really cute. It comes with an Elsa, which is awesome. And she's the only figure that comes in this one.